The entire landmass of the planet is made up of interlocking core model watersheds. That's the big secret. That's the invisible pattern that everybody on the planet lives within. The tree pattern is the watershed pattern. Just like a tree collects dew and rain and snow in its canopy, a mountain collects rain and snow and dust, but just on a way bigger scale. When rain and snow melt flows down a mountain, the water moves through the landscape in the same pattern as the tree's branches. Small springs and streams combine to make larger creeks which combine into rivers. So when we take this watershed pattern and we place it in a sequence, we have an undulation between the forces of concentration and dispersion. The concentration is when water is flowing down through canyons, creeks, washes, wadis, and picking up speed and picking up particles of soil and organic matter into the water. But then at a certain point, the pattern of the water flow changes and water goes from concentrating its energy to dispersing its energy. Then you realize that the core model is a map that you can use to understand where a site that you're designing is positioned within the landscape and what the dominant forces are that you need to pay attention to. When you take our online permaculture design courses through Oregon State University, you learn how to apply this information to the actual design of a permaculture site.